Hello guys, so I'm back and these are my hourglass blushes. Uh, over the past month, I've been so obsessed with these blushes. They're just so beautiful. They're luminous. They give you this beautiful glow. I just, I don't know. And I love the pattern on them. Okay, so I'm going to get started since I'm already getting into that. This is Ethereal Glow. This is my newest one. So, so cute. I love the pattern on them. This is a very, very, very light pink. It almost doesn't even show up on me. It's so light. So I might use it as a, um, maybe an all-over powder. Almost like Girl on Meteorite, because it does have a little glow to it. Check that out. Look how white that is. It's like, it's like a really, really white pink. Definitely has a glow to it. And there it is, watch. You see it 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 just blends right in. <laughs> yeah, so I'm definitely keeping it in because I love I love these um I love these blushes so much. I love what they do to your skin, how they make your skin look. They're so pretty. They don't emphasize pores. Radiant magenta. This is the one that started it all. I love this. This is probably my favorite one. Check it out. It's so pretty. Look at the shimmers in there. This is like a fuchsia mixed in with um, little gold. Gorgeous. So gorgeous. So, so gorgeous. This camera doesn't know justice. It's funny, guys. No justice. But. It's very pigmented, so it shows right up on a swatch. Check it out. So pretty. Part of the sparkles that is left over from my last video with the um, Illusion de Ombres and the Fusion Mono eyeshadows. <laughs> but that's Radiant Magenta right there on top, and it's so pretty. Definitely one of my favorite blushes in my collection. This is Incan Incandescent Electra. Oh, it's fun. This one really stole my heart. Look at the shimmers. This is a peach, and it definitely has a glow to it. This is probably one of my glowiest blushes. This is very, very pretty. This one is very, very close to my heart. I love it. So beautiful. Check that out. Now, you can see the shimmer on there, that one. On that one. So. Oh, it's so beautiful. Right there on top. It's so, so beautiful, guys. I'm looking at it. Uh, looking at my hand right now, I'm just like, whoa. That's gorgeous. So. So those are those three blushes. And I'm not going to knock that over. And this is a palette. This is the ambient lighting palette. It has luminous flush and candescent electra. Bam. <laughs> and mood exposure in it. And I did notice after I bought this that I already have it in here when I got home. So I'm okay with that. You know why? Because I love incandescent electra. So I have a backup of it basically. Here we go. All right. So this first blush right here is Luminous Flush, Middle is Incandescent Electra, and look at the shimmers, and then you've got Mood Exposure. I'm going to swatch all of these for you. Luminous Flush, my favorite Incandescent Electra, and Mood Exposure is supposed to be like a mauve, a mauve color. According to Tentalia, but I'm not seeing that. I'm seeing more of a bronzer. <laughs> as far as like my skin tone, I'm like you know I'm very very fair, so that would totally go over the bronzer on me easily. So and right there on top, you have this little palette of triple beauty. 
Yeah, I'm looking at Word. It's crazy right now. There we go. Minute Sage is showing up. But yeah, I could definitely use that as a light bronzer. Minute Sage there. Yep. So yeah, those are my hourglass blushes. I'm in love. I want more. I want hourglass to come out with more colors because I'm gonna buy every one of them. I mean, just look at look at the little swirly design. It's so pretty. Little swirls. I'm sorry, but I have to pick this one up and look at it again. It's just so. Look at that. It's so pretty. All right, guys. That's stuff I have to do, but I wanted to show you these hourglass blushes. They're pigmented. They last all day, seven to eight hours on me. They don't. They're not splotchy. They are powdery in the pans, but when you put them on your face, they're like a Chanel blush here, except for they're actually more pigmented than Chanel blushes. So be careful. Um, as far as it's especially, uh, what is it called? Uh, radiant magenta. That one you have to be really careful with because that one can be very, very pigmented. So. But I just wanted to tell you that I love these blushes. They are awesome. Yes, they're hyped up, but there's a reason for it. And um, have a great rest of the week, and I will see you later.